Cobblestone Park Golf Club. We are located in uh, Blythewood, South Carolina, which is about seven miles north of Columbia, straight up Interstate 77. Uh, you know, we were private for a long time, but we've opened our uh, gates to uh, daily fee play this year, actually last year, and we get a lot of play in the springtime from uh, north people from the northeast, northern Midwest. Um, especially during Masters Week, everybody floods down to this area. And, uh, we enjoy meeting a lot of people from all different areas, you, uh, especially the ones up north. Right this course was designed by PB, PB Dye, um, they they opened they in 1995. Wonderful. Uh, a little further, uh, Lee Jansen actually uh, redesigned uh, nine holes on our gold course. Um, did, we did all the greens complexes and uh, we did a couple holes completely in 2006. We have 27 holes. Well, uh, Cobblestone Park Golf Club is different than most courses in the Columbia area as uh, we're located on the, uh, the highest point in Richland County. County. Um, the, a lot of hills out here, people are really surprised when they come out and play it for the first time. Um, some of the vistas from a few of the holes, you can overlook the pine trees and, and hills and see for 10 miles in some areas. We're home of the, uh, the University of South Carolina Gamecocks men's and ladies golf teams. Um, we have a reputation in the Columbia area for being one of the best golf courses. There are a lot of nice courses in Columbia. Uh, we're always in great condition. But I think the, uh, the hills and, the, and the, the scenery going around the golf course makes us special. Wow, uh, we have probably uh, several of them, but uh, one of them is just a short par three number 11. Um, it's a hundred and from the member tee it's 140 yards from the back tee it's 165 yards but uh, you hit to a, a, a peninsula green uh, surrounded on water by three sides and uh, from an elevated tee it's just a gorgeous little golf hole. Well um, you know when I first came here after living in Pinehurst for a lot of years I can always consider myself a pretty good putter but I, I three putted all over the place. Um, the, uh, the greens have a lot of undulation to them, um, you know, so we can't, can't slick them up to 12 or 13 on the step meter, but we can get them to 10 and a half um, or 11 sometimes, but uh, just being on the right side of the hole is really important on this golf course, so the greens, I think, make the course very special too. We are cobblestonegolfclub.com. Y'all uh, hitch up your trailer and uh, Come on down and play some golf at Cobblestone Park. We're on the uh, Cobblestone Park Golf Club, number two on the black course. Um, we have 27 holes here, so the three nines are named Garnet, Black, and Gold. This is number two on the black, and number 11 today. A little 140 yard from the member tee, downhill, par three, over water to a peninsula green. Uh, not that hard a shot, but very intimidating to a lot of people that uh, don't see the green, they see the water more than they see the green. But um, from the back tee, it's about 165 yards, but just an aesthetically beautiful hole, water on three sides of the green. We are uh, halfway between Columbia and Charleston, off of Interstates 95 and 26. We're right between 95 and 26, so right on uh, the lower part of the state of New York. NT is a great lake for fishing, recreation. It's also a shallow lake. You have to be careful out there and make sure you have somebody show you around your first time. Great lake, uh, 104,000 acre lake. You can actually put in and get all the way down to Charleston in the harbor. So great golf courses around Lake Marion Golf Club, Santee Cooper Golf Club, and Santee National right here within a mile of each other. And then across the interstate, we have uh, the Manning area, Wabu and Wabu Players Course, also Shannon Green's Golf Club. And down towards Charleston, we like to send people down to Pine Forest and Crowfield and some of the other good ones down that way. The golf course here is a four-star Golf Digest rated golf course. Uh, 
The designer was Porter Gibson. It was built in 1989. It was damaged by Hurricane Hugo two weeks before it opened, but got renovated again, cleaned up, and uh, it's a fantastic course. The front nine's pretty wide open. You can go low, do some good scoring out there. The back nine gets, gets a little tighter, but uh, overall it's user-friendly.